Hi everyone, and welcome to the universe of Ethereum, your new RTS for PC from Tindalos Interactive, coming for download very early next year. In Ethereum, you'll be taking command of three different factions, fighting a war on a galactic scale over the control of six planets holding a rare and prized resource, the Ethereum. The humans from the Consortium, a sprawling corporate empire with great resources, stealthy agents and units who see Ethereum as a new source for great profits. The Antari, a fanatical alien race for who Ethereum is the key to their elevation to a new stage of evolution. Ethereum provides them with precognition powers. And finally, the Vectides, a materious life form that appears to be a symbiosis of technology and pure Ethereum. A typical solo or multiplayer game in Ethereum will first see you land a colony ship on the game map, which will act as your main base. Build your first Ethereum extractor, providing you with your first source of income to purchase and call down your first units. In Ethereum, you develop your base by sending command squads to build outposts and capture territories. Certain territories contain prized Ethereum spheres, increasing your income as long as you manage to hold it and maintain an extractor. With enough resources, call down your dropships from your fleet for reinforcement. Infantry, vehicles, tanks, artillery, walkers, airships, and even huge colossi of war whose mighty power will loom over the battlefield. At first, only basic units will be available, requiring the upgrade of your tech level to unlock more advanced units, thanks to the tech centers you can build on your main base and outposts. But beware, if an outpost with one of these gets destroyed, your tech level will drop as well. Develop your bases by adding various extensions, expanding your planetary capabilities, garrison to increase the number of troops you can deploy, tech centers to unlock units and abilities, spaceports to call down reinforcements to outposts, and orbital cannons to attack the enemy fleet. Don't forget to build defense turrets to protect your assets. Winning battles requires not just overwhelming your opponent with units, smart use of the unit's characteristics, such as infantry able to use forests and ruins as cover, and units specifically dedicated to fighting other kinds of units, will be necessary to overcome your adversary. Your mighty Colossi of War Assault will be for naught if you don't provide anti-air support. Each planet also has its own weather events, and you can exploit some of them to your advantage. Sandstorms on Serenade will immobilize troops, the blizzard on Arctis will freeze lakes you can then cross to execute flanking attacks, and hurricanes will prevent calling for reinforcements. The entire faction can predict these events and even trigger them at will. As a fleet commander, you also have access to useful command skills able to turn the tide of battle. Forced March will grant a temporary boost to a unit's speed, allowing them to quickly reach the battlefield. Retreat lets you save the unit from certain doom, while orbital bombardment allows you to harass and flush out entrenched units from afar. All three factions also have their own specific command skills, such as the Vectai's distortion field, the Antares teleportation, and the Consortium's spy satellite. Hostile sub-factions also dwell on some planet's surfaces. Brutal raiders, ancient rogue AI, and a dangerous creature race that you are able to destroy and claim their territory or subdue to your own will and use their units. Ultimately, you will have two main ways of winning a battle, either by totally annihilating the opponent's foothold on the map by destroying their main colony, or alternatively by destroying their fleet. Ethereum isn't only limited to warring on the planet's surface, its main solo game mode will have you battle it out across the galaxy against the opposite factions. In this mode, you plan your tactics on a turn-based galactic scale, building and sending fleets to colonize planets, developing your technology tree to give you an edge in battle, and spying on the enemy to discover their own objective or technological advancements. Colonize new planets and invade the enemy's territories, sending you straight into real-time strategic view to resolve the battle. Developing new technology will allow you to use new units and base extensions during battle. Prevent the enemy from completing their objectives while you complete your own, or annihilate the enemy fleets and victory will be yours. Three empires, one galaxy, your strategy. Ethereum will be available early 2015 for download on PC.